Oh, well, there we go. <laughs> oh, you motherfuckers up, man. Shit, what's going on? How y'all doing today? All right, all right. All right, I don't want to see you look people coming in. Y'all, Wally the shot caller coming up, man. Wally, you ready to tell this motherfucker up? Wally! DJ, I'm still with my name. What's up, man? Get up, man. What kind of motherfucker are you saying, man? We ain't talking about Wally and Wally singing music. This ain't the Batman TV show. Well, they uh, had about three of those. 
you wouldn't be eating your nuts at the bar. <laughs> they put that kid under the microscope for me looking at and I wouldn't be eating that kid to a homeless motherfucker. <laughs> you know you got friends that don't always wash their hands when they go to the bathroom. And if you got finger food in all your friends' decisions, that might be uh, oh, who cut the mouth off on me? A motherfucker that I'm telling on, get it? I know that's what happened. If you got all your friends as bitches, then you okay. If you would die, but if you another bitch. No, I don't want no pussy use, nuts. <laughs> and you would die, but if 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 you would I come in, the first thing him and he free to say, you want some nuts? <laughs> Hell no, I come out and I'm coming in. Don't eat the nuts. <laughs> My brother, if I get hungry, I'm going to eat some nuts. Well, nigga, you'll be eating nuts in the ball of your sauce. <laughs> Motherfucker. Okay? So I explained to him why I don't want no nuts. And he's been trying to push the nuts on me all night. <laughs> No, thank you, bartender. I do not wish to taste your fucking walls. Okay? So then I have to go outside and smoke a little cigarettes in case somebody from my job here. <laughs> I ain't gonna say what kind of smoke, but I carry a pack of Newports just in motherfucking case. <laughs> so I leave my Coca Cola on the bar and I come back and this motherfucker looking suspicious. I had to tell you, my husband been in the penitentiary, so you can use the daybreak girl on me. But I tell you now, I weigh 165 pounds, and I'm guaranteed to throw your motherfucking back out. You're going on disability if you drug me, motherfucker. <laughs> Speaking of drink, I'm going to have my GBR again, or whatever the fuck they call it. It's straight, too. People I ain't had to drink all year. I told my brother that he thought that shit was funny seeing how the day on the 11th and I'm a cold alcoholic. How about that? When I get home, I might have to go on and drown my sorrows for him talking shit to me. And that bottle of Patron I got sitting on my nightstand. But he just fell me off the way. Pushed me off the way. I didn't fall off the goddamn. That motherfucker right there pushed my ass. Shit. And anyway, oh man, I did the show Friday. Why don't you buy no tickets from me? I have to stand outside like a common person to sell my tickets. They gonna pay a motherfucker. You get half your ticket sales. Well, why you didn't give me my tickets on Monday and tell me that? You just gave me the motherfuckers this morning. Well, get on out there with the rest of the slow motherfuckers. Well, you didn't get your money. Well, I'm a hustler from wrong way back. I kept running in there. I need some more tickets. Uh, yeah, I picked up a good little piece of china. Hey, ladies, I want to ask you something. And I don't feel bad for me not asking you motherfuckers nothing, because I just don't care. I'm happy to be married. You have a proper nice cherry. You know, like they don't have a time to have a cherry. Hey, pasta bitch, cherry, pasta bitch, cherry. Yeah, we do that on the to do it. But you can only do it once per night. And you don't do it to all guys. It's usually the uncircumcised cat where you get the pop of the cherry. How you do it is you take the dick, because you know that hole is really little. And if they got a healthy dick, you'll hear a pop when you hear it. Pull that motherfucker down. Now when you do it though, be ready for the surprise. Because all around in there you're going to see a bunch of wet, green shit, car keys, shit. If you don't buy your pencil out the air, one of them might be in that motherfucker. That shit going to be all nasty looking like Tortoise and shit. I'm sure I'm not going to have to fall off. Interrupting my motherfucking head, remember? Yeah, that's my little brother. He's been talking up and making my own medical sister's boy out here. That's funny because I'm older than him. But I paid his ass back. I still agree to this shit. He tell him I'm going to pay for this shit. I don't. Fuck him. He done asked for shit. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, when you do that, this is why I say you only do it once. Because once you see that shit, you ain't gonna fuck with that motherfucker no more. Because if you look crazy, you know how some, some cats have that mushroom dick? Yeah. You know, the kind of fall right over the dick and then it's the stick. Y'all don't know about the dick? She ain't got a nigga in here. Well, you tell them about living. Well, I'm going to go over there with the mic. You got all that baby. I'm going to ask you the dick. I don't know. 
But anyway, they got the mushroom head over it. But if this is an uncircumcised motherfucker, it's gonna be little scrappy things right around the way to Bob I too. Nasty dude. Hell yeah, nasty motherfucker. And that Bob I just gave out that joke, the host kicked me out. I know that's the one of the two old men circumcised. Good job. Like, this bitch out telling me about this, she don't even know me. No, nigga, but they put your business on Facebook.